Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Big Baby JTV. Like, comment, sub, like, comment, and of course, subscribe. Let's get right into it. Let's get right into it. We're going to talk about lying as B-I-T-C-H's. Why are we talking about that? We're talking about the story of FTN Bay and uh, Doobie Low. Now, I do cover a lot of mainstream popular figures, celebrities, interneters, YouTubers, all that stuff. These people are not that famous, not that known, but I have to talk about this story. So who are they? Doobie Low is a rapper off Lil Durk's OTF label, right? Uh, and he uh, basically has gained a lot of steam recently because of a controversy that started a few months ago where FTN Bay, a stripper influencer rapper right which is a lot of these new age rappers these days stripper influencer rapper right uh she accused doobie low right of molesting her son right now i'm not i didn't go into the weeds or the background i found general information right so i i ain't trying to get tasha cade okay this news item came out a while ago, right, a few months ago. And for me, I didn't want to cover it because I didn't want to know the full details. And an accusation that's that harsh, that severe, is better to wait and see rather than pass judgment right away. And guess what? I was right to do that. I was absolutely right to do that because about a week ago, shout out Shmurda. It came out that Doobie Low did a lie detector test and was in contact with authorities and he was found innocent of doing this disgusting act, right? Because the kid, the son, fessed up to say that he made it up. And at a certain point, I believe about a few days ago, FTN Bay, right, she went on Instagram and apologized on Instagram Live to Doobie Low for that for whatever he went through right and i'm happy that happened but then now i i checked this news item by yesterday ftn bay said that uh do below coerced him coerced her my bad into saying that on ig live and that he still was touching on her son and he had touched on her son and she had some kind of other proof right if you look at official records, Doobie Low is completely innocent. You know what I'm saying? But according to her, she felt that he had coerced her, right? This is why I don't believe all women. This is why I don't believe all women. Why? Because I respect women so much that I realize women are human beings. Okay? Y'all MFs need to realize that women are human beings. Okay? And human beings lie a lot they lie a lot especially after a breakup especially if it involves other humans they've been intimate with especially if it's other humans they're still in love with i'm telling you right now fd and bay definitely had a relationship with doobie low 100 percent. now the extent of that relationship we don't know did they was they just hooking up for a week were they dealing with each other for a month a year who knows man who knows they were not a public relationship definitely and i guarantee you they were dealing with each other to the point where doobie low definitely broke up with her or did something to her that broke her heart broke her feelings and she manipulated her own son into making up this story she told her son to make up this story and this is disgusting this is disgusting there's no way a kid is going to make that up out of thin air and accuse another grown man of that unless the mother had some effect on it. And this is what I hate, bro. This is why we need fathers in the house. This is why we need to flame out and call out these disgusting, repulsive, dumbass, lying ass hoes. Facts. She should be in jail, pretty much. She should be in jail because, look, if, if he had actually done these crimes, Right, which he was found innocent for. If he actually did these crimes, he has to be under the jail. He, I'm cool with firing squads, bro. I'm cool with us bringing our back the death penalty for, for folks who are doing that, disgusting monsters who are doing that to little children. Okay? But then what happens when a kid lies because of their lying, hating-ass mother? 
what happens to them? Nothing. Nothing is going to happen to FTN Bay. That's a society we live in, bro. This reminds me of a certain thing. Y- y'all remember the Amber Heard situation, right? Where Amber Heard uh, was lying on uh, on Johnny Depp saying that he had put the hands on her, put paws on her, and was abusive to her. She later admitted that she was lying. What has happened to Amber Heard? Amber Heard is starring in Aquaman 2 and another Justice League movie. Nothing is happening to that bitch. She lied on this man. And nothing is happening to her, bro. No consequences. This is how I realize this society is messed up. It's immoral. It's corrupt. It's it's evil. Where a woman can easily lie on a man and nothing has consequences is zero. Matter of fact, there's women to this day still on FTN Bay side, even when she admitted the, and apologized to do below. There's women on Amber Heard side. That's how I feel that sometimes these pieces of shit, man, like, I don't even know, man. They deserve punishment for this, man. You cannot get away with this, destroying a man's reputation, destroying a man's character because you're heartbroken, because of y'all past. Disgusting, wrong, and we need to stand up again. Let me know what y'all think in the comments below, man. Let me know what y'all think in the comments below, right? Don't y'all find this disgusting? I do, man. I do, man. I do. And in a society where we're okay with women lying on a man about, you know, something as serious as molestation, something as serious as physical abuse, <laughs> it, 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 it ruins other women's voices, bro. The ones who generally go through this, right? Women should be pissed at these other women, man. But nothing's going to change unless you speak on it, right? Big Baby JTV, like, comment, sub. <sighs> I made a video about the truckers in Canada on my Patreon. Y'all y'all sub to my to my Patreon link in bio. Support the man, man. Big Baby JTV, we out, bro.